This is no 3D fantasy doodle or a middle finger poke in the eye of the car design establishment. It is a working prototype of a vehicle that will be put into production, probably within the next two years, though it is not one that ULL ever see plying the wide open byways of Yankee Doodleland. Bengal simply wanted its global launch to happen on a more international stage than the Beijing or Shanghai shows are today, and where better than the show staged in the town where he received his design education. Okay, maybe there is some eye poking. He starts his pitch with a little model of a Fiat 500, from which he can remove what would be a 19.7 inch section, sliding the front and rear halves together. This is how much shorter our car is, and it seats four big adults comfortably. Specifications are scarce. But we retold the length is just a bit greater than a smart Fort Woe S, and the width is nearly identical. But it is considerably taller, and the sides are absolutely planar and vertical, so there is no tumble home confining headspace. All passengers sit quite upright, with their hips much farther above the floor than in most subcompacts. The front seats are spaced just far enough apart to accommodate the right rear passenger's legs between them, and they re both skewed about as much right as the rear seats are left so that the left rear passenger's legs fit between the door and the driver's seat. This also allows the front passenger's seat to be...